What's good, y'all? Welcome back to the channel, man. Um, look, y'all read the title. You know what this video is about. Um, look, I'm going to just get right into it. The Patriots beat the Vikings. Round of applause. Round of applause. Clap it up. The Patriots beat the Vikings today. Um... This game was, was probably one of the best games of the year. Um, it's a great team, you know what I'm saying? Two great teams. I have nothing but absolute respect for the Vikings. Um, they play great, you know what I'm saying? In a losing effort, they play great. Their defense, um, absolutely incredible, you know what I'm saying, coming into the game. I have nothing, else, I have nothing bad to say about the Vikings. Um, you know what I'm saying? Nothing. I can't say one bad thing. Their offense is amazing. They got talent on both sides of the ball. Stephon Diggs. We actually shut out Stephon Diggs for you know what I'm saying? For someone that's like a superstar on that team and, and as talented as he is, you know what I'm saying? I think who was I think it was Stephon Gilmore who was covering him most of the game. Um and then they mixed in Treadwell. Um there was also another one of their star receivers. You know, I think he's a rookie or something. But, um, yeah, this game was absolutely incredible on both sides of the ball. A couple of questionable drives um, late in the game. I think before it was a possession before Josh Gordon's touchdown. By the way, Josh Gordon had an absolute um, great game, had a touchdown that um, put us up. I think it was 17-10. Um, and then we came down the field after we got stopped. And then we scored with James Devlin, who had a great game, two touchdowns. Um, I think this is the third touchdown on the season for him. So, you know what I'm saying? Um, defense, defense came out and, and did exactly what I needed them to do, which is play absolutely fantastic. We got um, a whole lot of stops early. You know what I'm saying? Got some pressure on Kirk Cousins. What, what else? The run, the run defense was iffy the entire game. Um, made made some good stops, you know what I'm saying, early. But it was, I wouldn't say it was terrible, but it wasn't that good, you know what I'm saying. Um, as for the passing defense, the passing defense was great. I think we only gave up one touchdown, um, which is cool, you know what I'm saying. It happens. We're not perfect. Brady had um, another good game. He had a pick um, late, kind of on him, you know what I'm saying? But it's all good. Now, um, look, man, we nine and, what is it, nine and three? Heading into week 14. We play the Dolphins next week. I think they beat, they beat the Bills, but it's the Bills, they're not good. Um, we got to go up against Danny Amendola one more time for this season. Um, still miss Danny Amendola. But, you know, it's the Dolphins. For some reason, they always think, you know what I'm saying, here, here we go again, you know what I'm saying? This is exactly the same situation that happened last year where we beat them, and I think, I think now it's like we have to actually beat them again. You know what I'm saying? We have to actually win out if we want the first seed. Um, by the way, speaking of first seeds, Kareem Hunt got released by the Chiefs this week. So when it, when it comes to um, the playoffs and, you know what I'm saying, winning, winning the rest of the season, you know what I'm saying, going on some type of win streak, obviously we, we play the best in December. Um, so this is obviously going to be a huge month for us when it comes to getting our um, 
you know what I'm saying, picking up where we where we leave off every goddamn season and just going crazy in December. Um, but for Kansas City, who um, beat the Raiders, I think I think we we um we shouldn't have a problem if we do see see them in the playoffs. Now, if we don't, then for obvious reasons, people gonna talk about oh well, if Kareem Hunt was playing, then y'all would have lost. You have to realize Kansas City never does anything in the playoffs, but for some reason always has, you know what I'm saying, just an, an absolute fantastic regular season and then just never show up, you know what I'm saying? It's quite opposite of what we do, you know what I'm saying? As Patriot fans, we obviously, you know what I'm saying, real out like we go crazy in the regular season and our real season don't start until we get to, to the playoffs in January, do you know what I'm saying? For most people, their um, regular season wins when it comes to beating the Patriots, they take them as Super Bowl victories. You know what I'm saying? For example, the Jacksonville Jaguars or the um, Kansas, not the Kansas City Chiefs, the um, the Titans and the Colts. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, how did the Jaguars only win by six points? Niggas is trash. Um, but anyways, man, speak. When it comes to this game this week, I am impressed. You know what I'm saying? I like I said, I have nothing but respect for Minnesota. I enjoyed the game. Harmon, Harmon came through and made a made an interception. Duran Harmon made a clutch interception after we turned the damn ball over on some bullshit. There was a questionable guy, that, like the refs. For some reason, we made a stop on fourth and inches. How the hell? How in the hell we make a stop on fourth and inches, right? This is a questionable fourth and inches. Like, they go for it. The Vikings go for it. We get the stop. They give them a first down for goddamn forward progression. But the nigga didn't even get back to the line of scrimmage. How do you give him forward progression after he got stopped at the, in the backfield tech? Technically, he was stopped in the backfield, so it's like play over there. Like, we throw a challenge flag. You know what I'm saying? We should have won that challenge. They shouldn't even have the damn ball anymore. You know what I'm saying? But it's whatever, man. We got the W. Um, and, yeah, heading into week 14. Hopefully, we beat the Dolphins. We should beat the Dolphins. I have nothing else to um, say about the Dolphins. They are absolutely terrible. Um, they beat the Bills. Oh, you know what I'm saying? The Bills is trash. It's not impressed. It's not impressive. Um, it's almost like beating the Browns. It's not impressive at all. Do you know what I'm saying? Oh, you beat a 3-17? Uh, a trash. You know what I'm saying? I think that the Bills were 4-7. You know what I'm saying? Trash. But anyways, we should beat the Dolphins. And then we play the Steelers. So, yeah. Looking forward to it, man. Um, that's going to do it for this video. Smash the like button if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel as well. If you ain't already subscribed to the channel. I'm stuttering. Shut up. You need to shut up and just end the video. Subscribe to the channel. Turn on post notifications. If you ain't already got your post notifications turned on, just hit the black bell on the side of the subscribe button. And then leave some um, video suggestions down below in the comment section. And I will see y'all in tomorrow's video. Thank y'all for watching. I love y'all with all my heart. Take it easy. Peace. Lonely. I am so lonely. Why am I not turning the camera off? I don't know. I have no idea. The camera is still roaming. The camera's
still rolling. Goodbye.